Hey, Creative Weirdos. So today we're going to look at The Substance by Carolee Forja. And their script won Best Script at the Cannes Film Festival this year. The film is striking, visual, and, you know, disturbing in a good way. We're going to look at the inciting incident as well as how characters always get the call to action to change and grow and move forward, but they always retreat, go in a little bit and retreat. And then finally the world around them affirms that they need to get the fuck out of where they are and keep moving forward. And in this case, Elizabeth is, you know, feeling the pressure of society of getting old and all those things, even though she's accomplished and everything like that, but there's aspects that are pushing her out because she's old. But this is really, really well done. And luckily the script is out, thank God, because it also won best script. So it's going to be out there and I'll put it in the description below. So let's dive into the substance. You can check it out at Mubi or Mubi.com because it just came out. So in the script around the 12 page mark essentially is the inciting incident but usually characters will refuse the first call to action something that is obviously related to their goals but also it opens up their lives and puts them on a path that they need to go on but initially they always refuse because it comes out of left field as they say lucky day miss sparkle because we have x-rayed you from head to toe and you don't have so much as a cracked molar so you are good to go uh, vaccination, okay, not throwing out any medication. By the way, I just want to say, my, my, my wife is a huge fan. Um, blood type, oh hey, it's your birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> oh, uh. That's an emergency. I'm sorry. I, I uh, have to have a... Yeah. Um, bye. One moment. There's just one last exam to perform. I thought he said I was good to go. Problem. No, it's perfect. You're a good candidate. I mean, you're good to go. I wish you the best. So this is the opportunity, obviously. Weird, ominous. Lizzie? <laughs> Lizzie Sparkle? Oh my God, I can't believe it. So yeah, this whole situation is essentially affirming that she's old. It plays into the inciting incident where there is hope, but she doesn't know what this is and all of this is to affirm in her mind, like, I need to change. The world is telling me I'm old. The world's telling me I'm old. So I need this. So obviously the character goes about their life, goes on a drinking bender and things like that. And when she comes back home, obviously she's not young and youthful, obviously still. So her life is going down the strain where she's trying to drown her sorrows. Like this is this is just visuals to show her life, what she's you know all this time, her successes and everything like that. You know she wants to go back to the old days, and this is like. This is done in other films yet, yeah, like looking at the past, looking at this figure of what you were. So the frustration is building. Yeah, you can hear the. 
the audio perfectly right on the eye. Yep, now she is ready to do it. So they refuse, and then when life keeps pushing them... Hello. I'd like to order. Address. 1057 Beverly Canyon. Write this down. 35 North Byron Alley. 35 North. So she hasn't taken the opportunity yet, but this visual cue of, you know, she's getting old, she's being replaced, that you established in the first act prior to the inciting incident, look at that. So, now she's formulated her goal. Mm -hmm. There it is. She's ready. So, always characters get the opportunity to change their life but they always refuse then life makes it harder for them and then they're like fuck it i'm gonna do it much like neo goes along with his first inciting incident follows trinity and then is at the office and follows morpheus for a bit you know he's on the phone he tells him go out the window once neo gets you know is afraid he doesn't follow through so he falls back and then when the agents do that horrible thing to him, then he realizes it's, it's also real. So then he goes forward. So honestly, this is a good film. Check it out. Uh, I will put the script in the description down below. Thank God it's out for a new film. If you like more of this content, comment down below. Any other films that I can look at, let me know. If you haven't already subscribed, hit the bell notification for more creative and educational content every week. Or if you need help with your upcoming film or story projects, check out our website and our new guided story structure notebooks that help make plotting your scripts and stories a breeze.